I, uh, I was speaking at, a, at an event like this in St. George, Utah not too long ago, and there was a gentleman in the, in the audience, his name's David, sitting there, and after the deal was over, I was sitting there talking to David, and I, I just, you know, I'm always talking to people, trying to curious about how they got where they're at. And it's really, I, I want to know what are those defining moments. Write that down, defining moment. Because it, the, a defining moment is that moment when your leverage point takes place. It was when the, the pain of staying the same is greater than the pain of change. When we can get to that point is when we'll take the necessary actions to do the things that we need to do in order to go from where we're at to where we want to be. And so I'm sitting there talking to Dave, and I said, David, tell me a little bit about your story. He says, well, Brian, what you have to understand about me is that several years ago I was extremely overweight. I said, you're kidding me. No way. He said, yeah. He said, uh, matter of fact, what, what? I said, what happened? How did it all change? He said, you know, I was living with my mom. I think he was 19 or 20 years old at the time. And he said, I was living with my mom, and I went in the house one day, and I asked her if there was anything to eat. And she said, yeah, it's on the kitchen table. And he said, I walked into the kitchen table. I looked on the kitchen table, and there's this big bucket of greasy fried chicken. And he looked at that bucket, and he thought, you know, if I continue to do this, if I continue to eat this food, I'm just going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. And he knew that what, he didn't want that. That wasn't what he wanted. And so in that moment, it created enough leverage for him in an instant. Bam! You know, that's how long it takes to change from operating out of a disempowered state to an empowered Come state. Come to find out, he was actually the month before on the cover of Muscle and Fitness magazine. 